Now here are some more of your top stories in the morning rush. The city of Denver can start pre-certifying businesses for the state's five-star program. Restrictions won't be loosened until Denver can lower its COVID numbers and keep them there for at least a week. Denver is in level orange, which allows some indoor capacity. The five-star program would allow for even more. More than 14,000 Coloradans filed for unemployment last week. That is a decrease from the previous three weeks. The Colorado Department of Labor and Employment says there are more than 70,000 jobs available through the state's jobs database. Coloradans waiting for weeks for unemployment payments to restart have to wait a little bit longer. The state finally got the guidance it needed from the federal government updated systems. CDLE says they now are taking an extra step to fight fraud. The state says it's paid $10 million in fake claims and stopped $7 billion more from going out. President-elect Biden's COVID-19 plan includes a $1.9 trillion stimulus package. It includes $1,400 payments to Americans, plus more rental assistance for tenants, help for landlords, a temporary boost in federal unemployment benefits, and it extends an eviction and foreclosure moratorium. The presidential inaugural committee has announced who will be participating in next week's inaugural ceremonies. Celebrities like Lady Gaga and Jennifer Lopez will be part of it. The ceremony is Wednesday on the west side of the U.S. Capitol, and that's your morning rush.